Hey, this is Dave and Rich again at HouseParents.com. Today we're going to show you how to install a bathtub drain. Uh, this is the drain kit that we got and all the pieces, uh, these are all the pieces that it comes with. And this is basically how it's going to go. And it, the top piece here is going to go attach to that hole with this rubber gasket. And this bottom piece is going to attach at your underneath your drain with this rubber gasket and then we're going to screw this in from inside the tub just like this and this is one of those uh, uh, push button you just step on it to uh, step on it to close it step on it again to open it and so this is your this is going to be so your tub sits right here that's the drain of your tub we're going to add a, a rope of plumber's putty around here and then screw it in and that'll be locked tight that's all that's uh, just a a regular, uh, fr I guess, friction fit. And then all these are going to be pipe cemented together. This piece here, I already measured and, uh, and pre-cut, but this kit piece came uh, out of the package perfectly. So it's all going to depend on the size tub that you get, what, what you have to cut. So you're just going to have to trial and error fit it together. But uh, let's go ahead and, and get those assembled, and we'll mount it. So what I want to do before we glue this is basically just dry fit everything together to make sure it is indeed how I cut it and measured it. So I'm just going to stick all these pieces together and then we're going to put it on the tub and make sure it fits right because once you cement these together there's no going back. It's a permanent weld. And then one thing I wanted to show you is you can see that this that's sitting right there's a, it, this is not level. That's because your tub face is not level. And so it comes with a gasket that you put that is thinner on one end than the other. And so you put the thin part at the bottom and the fat part at the top. And then, yeah, I forgot about this guy. From inside the tub, this is your overflow cover, and it's going to go into those two screws right there. And then if uh, you ever get to the unfortunate uh, circumstance where your tub is filling up quicker than it's draining, water runs through this gap and down into this tube and then just out. So we're going to go ahead and put this on, make sure it fits one more time. And then if it's all good, we're going to go cement this together and make it permanent. Alright, so we slide that underneath, and both my holes are looking pretty good. So this is the bottom, the bottom drain. It's going to go here, and this is the top drain, the overflow. And there we go. That's going to line up with like so. We want a good, good fit. There we go. Okay, I think we're good. So, then all I have to do is... Oh, that's right. This gasket goes on the bottom. There we go. This. Okay, not too bad. Now we can go ahead and make this permanent. Okay, so here it is fully assembled. Um, everything fits the way we had originally planned, so now we can go ahead and make the final cement connections, and we're good to go. All right, so now we're using this, our purple primer here, and we prime all the joints, and this stuff, you can just hear the brain cells dying as you use this stuff. That's why we're outside. So all the inner joints we'll get first. And this primer dries super fast. And again, it's, it's more like a cleaner. And then after we get all the inner joints, we'll then get all the pipes done. 
and I already got pencil marks on the pipe so I know you want to make sure this it actually seats correctly and that you've got it in good so I drew the pencil marks on there when it was fully assembled so we know that we had a good fit and this primer cleans the surface and then the glue makes a permanent bond so once once we put this in it is it's it's going to be the way it's always going to be all right so now we'll just start assembling it and you put this stuff on and you put them together and you hold it for 15 seconds put this on one side and then you put it on where it's joining and then you put it in and you give it a slight turn and you hold it and it doesn't take much and that's going to be rock solid permanent never coming apart and then also you got to take care to make sure this gets aligned correctly because if you put them in crooked you're not taking them apart you're going to buy a new kit and then the last piece is the top piece Okay, so the, this is where your drain is going to screw into. This goes into the waste, uh, the P-trap, and this is your overflow connection. All right, it's set and good to go. So hopefully it all fits. Hopefully everything's lined up right. Okay, so here's the pipe that we assembled in the, we made in the garage, and, that, and here it is all assembled and in. And as you can see, that that's a rubber gasket between the, the PVC uh, elbow there and the the steel tub is a a rubber gasket and then there's two screws that are you will show you from the inside that go right through the um, overflow cover into this PVC uh, elbow and on the bottom this again is all the PVC part that we assembled and it has another elbow that goes up and this also has a rubber gasket right right there and the drain on the inside of the tub screws into this into this elbow and again it's sealed because it has a rubber gasket so it's, it's super easy to put in once you get all the measurements correct and that's the hard part so this piece right here is the one I said it, it just screws in to that PVC and there's your two screws that go into the that PVC el elbow and then underneath here is a gap and so when your water gets too high it just flows underneath here and in into the overflow tube and down I uh, hope this helps with uh, giving you an idea of how to get a handle on installing a, a tub drain. Uh, in the next video, we're going to show you how we actually installed the whole tub uh, after we had removed the, the previous cast iron one. Thanks a lot for viewing. Please subscribe. Don't forget to uh, click on the bell so that you get, a, you get a notification whenever we put a new video out. Uh, leave us a comment. If you've got any questions, go ahead and ask us. Um, we really appreciate the input. Thanks a lot for viewing, and we will see you next time. Uh, hello. What are you doing? What are you doing? I can't do a video if you're going to be doing this. No, I can't. I can't. Arr. Okay. Okay, can we sit nice for the video? And not bite me? No biting? No, no biting. <laughs>